All right. Finally made it, although the Elegy of Emptiness counter is not done yet. And now you're finally inside the actual temple itself. Took fucking long enough. Congratulations. All the shit that you've been through so far has been nothing. You're now finally now... at the area. <laughs> <laughs> now the battle truly begins. I remember there's something about this dungeon early on that get, always gets me stuck, and I always forget what it is until it happens. Hey, I did it accidentally. I guess I should count my blessings that the Deku is too, too uh, small to press down switches, or else they that would add another process to every single switch puzzle in this goddamn place. Ah, get me out of here. I don't even remember the names of those guys. Statuos. Ah, uh, yes. Statuos. Yeah, those are. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it ended with OS. Yeah, it's like Blados. Like a fucking operating system. I'm so sick of bomb shoes. I don't know why Darmani stanced up like that. He is a Goron warrior. So are all of the Gorons. He is the most warrior of all of them. Maybe the thing that I always forget to do is that you have to kill the Armoses. The oh, Armies. Armies. Like, killing all the Armoses is the thing that you wouldn't expect to have to do, and that would be the... the map. I thought you died. <laughs> Because when he exploded, it turned to white and you took damage, so I thought she just died. That would suck. Damn, an Armos explosion does three hearts of damage. Crazy. The worst part is the dungeon just started, but we've been in Econa Valley for, for like an hour and a half. That was not very good at his job. Oh, wait, there he goes. It took way too he, long. Don't you have to do that for a puzzle? Oh, yeah, that one. You can't just jump up there? Maybe you can with a really good jump, but we've already established that I'm shit with Zora Link, so... I don't understand this gimmick. Yeah, really... How do you charge it's... a mirror with light? It's not even clear that's what's happening. It's not very well explained. Maybe Tattle explains how Tattle's it works. That's fucking useless. She doesn't do anything. Wow, the map and compass already? You shouldn't have. This dungeon's clapped! The rooms are big, if that's what you mean. Oh yeah, the million suns, that most of which don't do anything. As per Zelda game with Mirror Shield. <laughs> I like this puzzle conceptually with transferring light across a room. In practice, it's kind of annoying. In practice, it's super annoying and very easy to fuck up, because that looks like a thing that can be punched out with Goron oh. Link. Yeah, I was I was thinking, like, that looks like the things you punch in the Snowhead Temple. It didn't actually occur to me to really actually do that. The fact that there's infinitely spawning enemies here really does not help. Hey, it's Nedgeron. You remember him? I do remember him. You said he only showed up in one, one small area. I thought he did. And yet, there he is. There he is. There he is. There you go. I think speedrunners, like, give the shield things one tick. And just are fast and know where to aim the shield. Uh, it's possible. Oh, come on. I, I don't know. I don't. If I was a speedrunner of this game, I would not know... It's How probably an exploit to this. fly. Honestly, it's probably faster to just fly all the way up with a bomb chew hover than it is to do the whole dungeon. <laughs> that probably would be faster, yes. Come on. You have to actually touch the sun on the sunstone. That's bullshit is what that is. Oh. Uh. Whoa. Yeah, I'm not interested, actually. At least the other forms are utilized, even though I don't like them. Yeah, yeah, because there's no transformation mask for this area, they just use all of them. As weird as it may seem, I think Deku Link is my favorite transformation. It's the most generally practical, that's for sure. 
Oh god, what happened to my controls? What the fuck is going on with my controls right now? I blame the camera. Yeah, it's just something with the camera is making the control stick act really weird. It's impossible to describe. Who is it, Don Jiro? It's just a Jiro. Giro. I don't know how you're supposed to say it. I think his name Giro. is Don Jiro. Taro Master. Who am I thinking of then? Uh, I. That does sound familiar, but I can't remember. It's the Frog Mask's name. Oh, yeah. That's right. What does that mask even do? The Donjuro mask? Yeah. It lets you talk to frogs. Does it do anything? There's like five, four or five frogs in the world you have to talk to with the mask, and then when you get them all together, get you get a heart piece. Two of the frogs are the frog mini-bosses. So you have to go through and do those mini-bosses again. And then there's one in Clock Town. And two elsewhere. Yeah, I forget what the other ones are. That's a pretty easy mini boss. This, this fight, this boss, this dungeon actually has two mini bosses. I don't even remember what the other one is. Uh, you probably will once we see it. I remember the actual boss of this area, and I remember the Garo Master. Nice face. Uh... Oron Slam. Bombs? Bombs? <laughs> Fuck your helmet. Fuck you and your helmet. And your mom. I'm surprised Gorgon Link made that jump, honestly. Yeah, me too. It's like that noise a lot. That's why I like this song better. It is a cool sound, I wonder what it is. I have light arrows, fuck you. There's no problem that can't be solved. Except for every single other puzzle in the game that does not require light arrows to, <laughs> to do. If there's a puzzle involving a sunblock, I'm all over it. Otherwise, you gotta figure that shit out yourself. I don't need sleep, I need answers. Is that from Taken 2? From something even more stupid. Taken 3? Big Bang Theory. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry I asked. <laughs> exactly. Flying backwards is just the name of the game at this point. You can fly backwards, you are cool. That's a law of th thermodynamics, I think. It's actually written in the Bible. Yeah, Jesus said that. He who flieth backwards. Pissed fool. Pissed to the least. Wow, this is even gonna be even better the fiftieth time. Doo -doo. Is there is there not even mini boss music? Is that just regular enemy music? Oh no way, it's this boss. I mean with how many times you've fought it, it is a normal enemy at this point. Yeah, that is that is kind of funny if that's... Oh god, I'm on fire. It doesn't even have enemy music, it's just still playing the Stone Tower Temple song. That's even sadder. Can't stand still, there's lava fucking falling everywhere. Ah! Stop! God damn it. No, don't make me run through all those puzzles again. I can't fucking do this goddamn puzzle, I have no magic. 
Why does this? Why do these pots give me hearts? I need magic. Open. Oh, thank God! I don't have to do this puzzle again. You played any F Zero GX that came out, or F Zero X that came out a few days ago? No. On what? Uh, the sixty four. It's a F. The it's the F Zero sixty four game. Oh uh, no, I haven't touched this in a little bit. Oh. Uh. I haven't either. I don't really like F Zero that much. I'm not a fan of racing games in general, so I can't imagine F Zero would be any different. I'm assuming you haven't heard about the shit with the new uh, Chocobo racing game. I haven't looked into it, but I, I heard it was a thing. <laughs> it's a full. It's like a fifty dollar game that has microtransactions up the ass. It is like, it's like a fucking gotcha game with how microtransaction and ad ridden it is. Fucking is it? horrible. You don't know what a Poe is? You stupid bitch! <laughs> Thank you, Tattle. Tattle, that's what I'm gonna do to you if you keep acting up. To leave you in a sad pile of dust. I'm gonna... <laughs> I'm gonna stab you 100,000 times and then leave you alone. That's a funny way to kill an enemy, I gotta admit. Honestly, I kind of want to get the uh, Great Fairy Sword just because it looks cool, even though I wouldn't use it. Now which one? Uh, it is. It's a big, it's like the big Aron Sword equivalent. No, I mean like, I'm assuming it's a Great Fairy Reward. Do you know which, oh. which temple Great Fairy Reward it is? It's this one. Hmm. You get the ultimate sword right before the final boss, and right before you get you would get fierce DD if you've been doing everything. So it's spectacularly redundant, but it looks cool, and that's what I care about. All right, here's the second mini boss, Batman. I heard that movie was good. I have not heard anything of it. You saying that is the first opinion I've heard about it so far. Do I not remember a Grim Reaper character? Yeah, I know. I was, with how, like, striking this guy is, I was kind of surprised. Ouch. Like, this still isn't ringing a bell to me. It's pretty fucking sick, though. What's he called? Gomez. Does that shed any light on the situation? Tell you're fucking hilarious. The way you fight, it's kind of lame. Shoot it with a light arrow, then do a jump attack. That's it. But it's a sick design. I wonder if there's like concept art for him that is not like N64 polygon shittiness. Like the Dyn like the uh, Lizalfos from Ocarina of Time, where their concept art is really dark and badass, but then their actual in-game model is whatever it is. What does Song of Storms even do in this game aside from unjinx you? Get you the re-dead mask. <laughs> well, and the plot thing that you needed for. I killed by a shockwave. Well, that's fine. I wanted to go to the beginning of the dungeon anyway. I'm so fucking sick of real bomb trees. I'm glad you guys are only in this game. Right, of course. What dungeon did I think I was in? I'm surprised you haven't had to play this more, actually. <laughs> it's never over when you think it is. That might be the last one, but I'm not going to say definitively. I played the song way more times than I needed to, but I wonder what the final count will be. What even is this? Is this the Giant's Mask? Yeah, you get the giant's mask right before fighting them. I thought it was gotten in the next room. Good 
big wormulon. Oh. Just once I want a Zelda boss subtitle to be something like stupid dumbass idiot. I think the only hard thing about this boss is that you have to do it with no Z targeting. Yeah, that is a rather difficult thing. Also, I agree. Having like Goma come out for the 50th time is like, oh god, this dumb fuck again. <laughs> this dumb fuck. This stupid waste of time again. Just shoot it already. Goma. <laughs> it's a full <laughs> paragraph. Just being rude. Are you fucking serious again with this, Nintendo? We're tired of seeing the same recycled bosses over and over again. I killed it the first three times with ease. <laughs> I don't need to kill it a fourth time. Goma. <laughs> Goma. <laughs> yeah, that sounds about right. You read the name and you're like, Twin Mold? Because you only see one of them and you turn around and see the other fucker. My god, that makes a lot more sense, actually. Oh. I see how boring this place and this boss fight actually is. Yeah, it's, uh... It's the, the, the sandworm boss with a twist. Oh. Okay. You know, the fact that Tattle is... Tattle and Navi are contextualized in the world as being the Z-targeting is like kind of funny when it's used like this, but it really makes you wonder why Link needs a little fairy glowing above the enemy to do that. So he can pinpoint a target. It's not like he has a sight or anything on anything that he does. It's just there's a little glowy dot so you can see exactly where it is. You, he has eyes. But he can aim at the glowy thing instead of whatever the fuck he's looking at. For reasons. Hmm. This is gonna suck, huh? Oh shit, I got him. Let's go. <laughs> Making an executive decision. Fighting him without the giant's mask blows. Unless you're playing 3D, then fighting him with the giant's mask blows. Then fighting him is the worst shit ever. He's almost dead at least. You can tell because he's moving faster. Oh, thank god. You saying that actually did damage to him psychologically. I love that every worm enemy just fucking explodes for some reason. One segment at a time. Oh, oh god. Oh god. That fuck. That scared the shit out of me. <laughs> you only get one of their heads. Yeah. I wanted the red one, goddammit. Mom, go back. You bought the wrong one. You ruined Christmas. We have twin mold at home. <laughs> Please stop talking. I don't have any friends. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, it's funny. It's funny you say that. <laughs> you know what? Fair enough. I know it's just to add to the absurdity of the situation, but how can you look at a fucking giant rock with a face on it and be like, yeah, it's fine. That thing's not going to destroy everything. My tide, the tides aren't moving, so why should I? <laughs> I've been watching the ocean for the past 12 hours. They haven't done shit. I'm very tired. I actually heard that this cutscene has... 
it has it deliberately has lag in it to simulate the N64 lag because the song was actually timed to the laggy cutscene. Yeah, that doesn't surprise me. And if that's the case, I I applaud that that uh that re shittiness because making it better actually ironically makes it worse. I really wish you showed what happens if you did this without all four of these guys. Here's what happens. Yeah, that's right. Admit you're strong. Yeah, that's right. You're a dumb fuck. Wait a minute. What did you say? It's kind of fucked up. He's reanimating a dead person right now. I wouldn't say he's reanimating it. Yeah. I like that if you do this part a second time, then Tattle's just like, yeah, let's just go. And Tail is like, wait, what? What are you talking about? Oh my god! Oh god. <laughs> I love that. I'll stay here with Tail. I'll do it! If you won't, I'll do it! I'll kick that thing's ass. Let me at him. Let me at him! Welcome to Windows! I don't remember which edition. It's been said a million times, but this part really is fucking awesome. How you just go to the moon and it's just an it's idyllic inside, landscape. It's inside of the moon, because you go in through his mouth. This is the inside of the moon. <laughs> There's just like rocky landscapes out there. There's a whole no. sun inside the moon. And it's constant, uh, constant, um... What is it called? Motion blur? And nobody says shit about this. That's the best part, is that nobody, that, uh... Tattle isn't like, holy shit, what's going on? We only... Why did I even collect these remains masks? If they're just gonna shit-talk me during the boss fight. They don't even go up in the right order. Also, I gotta say, I'm not really a fan of this final boss. I don't like it at all. Good music, though, as usual. This is a good start, huh? Oh god, here they come. Still in the wrong order. <laughs> <laughs> in the same wrong order, even. I don't even know what they do. They just shoot shit at you? Just there to be other uh, Z targets and they shoot random shit at you. Targeting Adola. There. Easy. Crazy that an all powerful evil mask gets fucked up by some fish dude. The boomerang, the ultimate Zelda weapon. A very acrobatic cool. fish <laughs> with boomerangs. Nice random hit. Yeah, I don't know what that was about. I wish she didn't grow arms. And the head. I wish it was yeah, just he the be... mask with legs. When he when he be, just becomes a humanoid, he becomes way less threatening. Even ignoring the fact that he just starts running around like a crazy person. I like the the music though. It is yeah. Oh, 
I uh, can't believe I actually hit him. Sliding knockdown. <laughs> <laughs> this is a good boss fight. I haven't even gotten hit yet. I'm sure I'll get hit in this last phase, because this last phase is actually kind of hard, but... But you're uh, incarnate, incarnate. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, it's still on the screen. Oh my god, that was such a high-pitched squeal when he was trying to whip you. He's very loud. He's also animated really cool. He reminds me of Zant in animations. Yeah, that's a... Good comparison point, I think. I remember when my mom was playing this game and she was on this part. She uh she got really sick of this this phase and is whipping from like halfway across the battle arena. She just put on the Zora mask, just ran up to him. And just started beating the fuck out of him, and it just kind of worked. That is all you really have to do. Stop! Oh fuck, am I dead? Oh god damn it. These masks are huge. The bosses were huge. They weren't that big when I picked them up, they couldn't even fit in my pocket. God damn it, why do I keep doing that? Okay, I wanted to press the Zora mask button for the boomerangs, I have no idea why. Oh, fuck. How is a fish weak to fire? That doesn't even make sense. Are there any grass type fish in Pokemon? <laughs> There's gotta be at least one. Surely. At least we get to hear the song again. Uh. <laughs> God damn it. For about 10 seconds. Uh. Okay, that was weird. Boy, he wiggling. Why is this one the incarnation? Because it's a childish uh, demon. You can't move when that's happening. <laughs> What the fuck, man? He wasn't being such a dickhead the first time. Yo, Majora's Mask, though? Hey, 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 yo. Oh, wait. I'm gonna summon these guys. If only we could fight all five bosses simultaneously. Power of better hardware, am I right? That would be awful. What do you mean? A three heart boss rush of Adala, Goat, fucking like Yorg, and Twin Mold. That sounds awful. And then having to fight the rest of this form, incarnate form, and wrath form. All with yeah. three hearts. Yeah. Sounds Why awful. Not? What do you mean? I would do it in my sleep. You died to go. You died to Georg. You <laughs> Did you die to Twin Mold? I f yes, and I fell out of the map for good measure. Yeah. <laughs> and you've died here. So what? It balances out. It would balance back out to being easy. Because all the bosses just hit each other. Can you fucking target him? God damn it, I forgot the targeting sucks. There we go. I love that he just Get... fucks around. And finds out. Yeah. Stop moonwalking. Japanese people didn't even know who Michael Jackson was. I'm 
this simultaneously with and nay nay. <laughs> if that was a dance when this game came out, he might have done it. He might have twerked and dabbed for all we know. <laughs> Can you imagine? I don't want to. I probably could, but I really don't want to. Spinning top. Rob. Forgot about, forgot about that shit. Oh fuck. This suddenly became a lot harder. Oh shit, the top hit him. Fuck you. <laughs> that was the stupidest way that fucking fight could have ended. Yeah. His own dumbass top hit him. Hooray, it's over. Alright, I'm gonna head out. <laughs> and suddenly Termina now doesn't have a moon, which equally fucks up the tides and no one is safe. Either that or they had two moons, which is also bad. <laughs> that how Hank Hill cries? <laughs> yeah. He just says blah in a shaky tone of voice. You know, something I'm surprised they never did was put in like a random giant footprint. In Termina or something. Unless there is and I didn't see it. I don't think there's one. He doesn't have any bad or ill will towards the Skull Kid, which is surprising. King DDD! The one on the bottom left is fucking scary. Yeah. It's like a horror movie mask. And then he just disappears. He turns into. N64 shittiness. But why don't you just fuck off? Okay. <laughs> I'm out of here. Fuck you. Fuck your dumbass fairy. Fuck your other dumbass fairy. Fuck the masked guy. Fuck you calling my name. I'm not even looking back. Where am I even going? I don't even know where I am. Don't fire the fireworks during the daytime. You can't see that shit. Oh, whatever. You can link back there, rocking out. Playing that one note repeatedly. He's going insane. Not on tempo at all. It's kind of weird that despite the game being all about how your actions ultimately don't really do anything, the ending seems to be a everything turned out fine anyway thing. Hey look, it's a mask. It's a hat. Can't fool me. Yay, I love the Romani mask. That's another hat. Reject humanity, become cow. Become bovine. Yeah, I think this is the blast mask one. Oh, does it show you cutscenes for all the masks that you have? Yeah, it shows you, like, the aftermath of you helping these people. Like, this is the bunny hood one. He drops her and she rolls down the hill into death. <laughs> she just somersaults repeatedly. The fuck is that one? That's the marriage mask? I forget. It's the one for you get for doing all the uh, cafe and Anju shit. What does it even do? It lets you get one heart piece. Wow. What a That's useful That's literally all it does. What a very useful installment. It's almost a joke. Like, you go through this side quest that takes up the entire three-day cycle that goes until, like, one minute before the moon crashes into the Earth. 
and then you get a mask which isn't even really a mask it's just a thing that gives you a heart piece I forget what it's actually called it might just be called the lover's mask I don't know Hey, look at that. They're friends, even though Link said fuck you and your fairy and your other fairy, I'm leaving. And there's the giants, for good measure. And Saria. Well, that's that. Fucking... Thus the Ugh. end of Masks Majora.